I actually started working with Christian Family Counseling um, right out of graduate school back in 2000. Um, this was my internship while I was in school and then I was hired on right after I graduated. I would say I have a few different areas that I tend to work in the most. What I really like and what I'm trying to develop a specialty in is, is um, women's issues. Um, over the years I've spoken for a lot of different women's groups and so I've really come to um, just have a heart for what women uh, deal with and some of their challenges and so uh, I do meet with a lot of women just with a variety of issues, lots of times just uh, stress, feeling overwhelmed with life, that kind of thing. Um, I do end up seeing quite a few adolescents as well. Um, I had a difficult adolescence so I know how tough it, high school can be and uh, college and so I really uh, love meeting with that group as well. Um, and then I, just because of the need I end up doing quite a bit of marriage counseling. I think that counseling in general can be very helpful but I think that often it can be just a band-aid approach um, in the sense that I don't, I don't see true healing taking place without uh, some type of faith in God and without the Holy Spirit's work in people. Um, I love to see the things that happen outside of the session with a client. I know that it's God uh, working in their lives and I can see so much change take place that's so not because of me but because of what God doing, is doing in people's lives. I tend to talk a lot about um, thoughts, um, so I, I guess a cognitive approach. I believe that a lot of the problems that people have are, have to do with what they say to themselves and lies that they have in their head. What I do is I help people to replace lies that are in their head, whether it's feeling bad about themselves, feeling guilty for no reason, things like that. If somebody is hesitant to come to counseling because you've never done it before, um, I would just say I see a lot of people like that and, and I can see that in the, after the first five minutes people tend to get very comfortable because they realize, you know what, I'm just here to talk about myself and most people like to do that and it feels good to be able to just um, verbalize what's on your mind. 